Hi, my name is Grant, and this is my memorial to my late partner, Lawrence Anderson. Uh, Lawrence had many health issues. We were together for over 15 and a half years, and he had many health issues, uh, mainly related to diabetes. He had a kidney transplant in uh, 2012. Um, a year later, he started ha having had his first complications from being on um, anti-rejection drugs. And then he was treated again for something related about six months later. And then two years passed to uh, 2016 um, when he became sick again for the first time um, as a result of us going to a very large uh, birthday party. And, and that was the first of, of five trips to the ER and four hospitalizations. Um, Larry, Larry passed away on um, the day after Labor Day in 2016 uh, as a result of a, a fungal infection, a fungal meningitis called cryptococcus, it, um, which is something that's that's everywhere, um, and it's a very common fungus, but for people who have compromised immune systems, they are at risk for getting sick. So this is my memorial to Larry, um, and I, I apologize for being a day late with this, but he passed, he was, his uh, life support was terminated on Labor Day 2016, and he made it to about 6.15 a.m. the next morning, September 6th, and this is recorded on September 7th. So I have laid out before you things that were related to Larry, um, and I'm also dressed the way we met. I won't explain how that, how we were dressed, but just I'm dressed the way we met. The things on the table are in the circle, it's, it's a, a set of uh, seven men that was something on Larry's coffee table for many, year, many years. They're, they're all embraced together, and um, I think of this as a fellowship circle. The um, lights around are uh, votive holders that came from Ikea, and I don't remember who got the white ones and who got the blue ones, but together we had... We had um, I think we have um, six apiece, and combined they are just enough to circle the circle of men. Um, this is the funeral card for Larry. Um, the little um, to the left here is a um, a drink uh, placemat place a holder for. Uh, from a restaurant called Coochie Coochie in Cambridge, Mass. It was a favorite place. We didn't go very often because it wasn't cheap, but it was a very place and very eclectic. Larry liked sandalwood, so the incense is sandalwood. This uh, Larry at one time had been a smoker, and this uh, brass and glass ashtray was a gift to him from his friend Teddy, uh, Teddy Coheras, who had passed away before Larry did. Uh, to the right is the funeral program, the and the as both the outside and the inside. Um, of course, the of course the heart beads beads uh, represent our love for each other, and we were we were a interracial gay couple, and those uh, rainbow beads were a gift from Larry to me. The um, cigarette lighter was also something made by Teddy. And said Larry used to be a smoker. He had quit by the time I met him, but, but that was something from Teddy. Larry liked comedies, and one of his favorite, favorite actors was uh, Cuba Gooding Jr. And on the table was the movie Boat Trip. Um, this is my purple tree. Larry liked purple, well, like, but the, re the purple tree is here for another reason. Um, but below that 
is a photo of our union service. It used to be in another spot, but I had to move it. So this gives you an idea of what my living room is like. It's decorated for uh, late summer um, because they're still green in the leaves, and um, but they're turning orange. The, these pictures in the corner and, and the fan and the uh, woven um, mat or um, were, were, were Larry's and those I inherited from him. The, um, the little uh, sun desk here was something that Larry had gotten at, a, at a, uh, our favorite bar as a uh, raffle. And he loved it, but he kept it here. And now it's part of my life. And finally, so there have been a lot of changes in my life in, in the last seven years. This is something called a, a bovida. It's, it's for um, honoring ancestors behind the bovida are pictures of my parents who have passed, who passed on. Uh, my mother passed in 2016 as well. She passed about four months before Larry did. My father passed away in December 2022. So this is a, a bovida in honor of them. But the, but the hearts around it and the, the candle holder and the, and the, and the uh, blue and silver hearts in front were things that Larry had had and that I've inherited from him. So initially this was basically a, a tribute to Larry, but on a Bovida you can't have people um, on the behind the Bovida who are living and the picture under the tree was both me and Larry and I'm still here, so they had to be moved. And finally, this is a photograph of tulips that was taken by Teddy. Uh, Teddy passed away, I think, in 2014, 2015, and he, uh, but he had given this picture to Larry a long time ago, and it's hard to tell here, but, but Larry did insist that he autograph it, so Teddy's autograph is on here. So, uh, the poster on the wall had also been Larry. There's much of Larry here in spirit, but, but he's passed on and I found new company and I hope that he's happy with the company that I, I now enjoy. And this is, so this is my tribute to Larry. This is my seventh year of doing this. So I don't usually do this long a video. Um, I, I don't know if I'll continue doing these, but this has been seven years since Larry passed away, so I hope you enjoy it.